This is the worst loadout for Heavy. That's all for this video, though. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later, Skater. It's a terrible joke. Each of these weapons don't complement each other well and overall create a horrifying loadout to use. Our minigun of choice is the Hulong Heater. People seem to think this is the worst minigun because the ammo consumption and the damage penalty punish you for staying active too long and hurt your damage overall. Some of you might ask about using the Brass Beast in its place, but that at least has value in a highly defensive circumstance that allow you to perform well with it in comparison to this. Many see the Hulong Heater as a weapon that requires team coordination to succeed, such as having a pyro in your team's spam flares. However, this only nets you about a 12% damage bonus against burning players. The math on the weapon isn't as clear-cut as you'd think, since it's not just adding percents, so it's not really a 15% damage bonus. Anyway, moving on. The secondary is going to be the Buffalo Steak Sandwich, no questions asked. Since the primary is the Hulong Heater, any shotgun I use could immediately make this loadout overall better, and having self-healing from any of the other lunchboxes makes it easier to play aggressively, so those are out too. Since the stake applies an effect to the melee weapon as well, we have to choose a melee weapon that has absolutely no synergy with its effect. That's why I'm using the Eviction Notice. It's the only obvious choice with the stake, as I otherwise would have to use the Warrior's Spirit as the worst heavy melee, but then combo that with some other secondary. Anyway, since we have the stake, we have to take a speed melee as they don't stack together almost at all, and the Gru are considered to be the superior choice between the two, so that's why we're using the Eviction Notice. Here's how it went playing with this loadout.
Overall, this really wasn't as bad as you might think. The Hulong Heater pretty much plays similarly to the stock minigun in most cases with the lower damage sometimes killing me, and only in one instance did I actually run out of ammo. The Ring of Fire also being a large obvious indicator of being spun up hurt me trying to be sneaky with it as well, but I found this Rev Tech to never activate it and waste ammo. Otherwise it was a standard day of playing heavy with slightly longer downtime due to... other factors. The stake was easily the worst part of the loadout. I hardly used it to go for melee kills on people, and any time I did, I never succeeded and just died instead. I also tried using it for rollouts as well, but that didn't really help much. It was exclusively used to feed teammates like you would with any other sandwich, and for staring at when I wished it gave me some kind of health back when I ate it. The ability to still feed it to teammates did help me out a bit though. As for how the eviction notice performed, it was actually great. They get a massively bad rep when they really don't deserve it. Yes, it's slower than the Gru, yes it does less damage than the Scout's Bat, and yes it still drains your health at a very annoying rate, but it still allowed me to do Gru things without having to use the Gru. While he has the Eviction Notice equipped, Heavy moves at about 264 hammer units per second, which is a bit faster than the Soldier's default movement speed. If you manage to hit someone with it, the speed boost it gives you lets you outspeed everyone except the Scout. It was really rare when it happened, but there was a moment where the speed boost actually let me outrun a pyro to safety and continue the fight against him, eventually killing him. This weapon really isn't as bad as people say. It's arguably inferior to the Gru since it's its own weapon on top of being a speed booster, while the Gru only gives you a speed boost. However, I'm inclined to agree because the damage is so pitiful even when it's used to attack people, and that got me killed on many occasions, even if those people were already injured. This was a pretty fun experiment overall, and I learned a bit about the Hulong Heater and the Eviction Notice as well. I always like messing around with various loadout combinations, and Heavy is always a delight to play when using other things, except for the Tommy's Love. That's all for this video though. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later, Skater.